I honestly cannot believe that I'm here again. This is my third time now on this range playing Russian Roulette because the internet has proven to surprise me. If this goes off on the first one, I'm going to be so mad. The channel has hit... Put the tooth story on the second channel? I could. Do people, is it worth it? <laughs> Do people really want to hear about my teeth? You guys want to hear a story? I don't know if I've said this to anyone on the internet yet. Um, I can't bite into apples anymore because I broke my two front teeth two years ago. I was playing hockey, didn't have a face cage on, didn't have a mouth guard in, like an idiot. Long story short, skating after the puck. I, I run into the back of my friend who is also skating after it and I lose my balance and I start to fall backwards. And on skates, it's really scary because if you lose your balance, you're toast. You're going down, you're going down hard and ice is like concrete. So I decide to, oh, I'll turn around and brace myself with my arms. Because if I just fall straight backwards, I'll like break my coccyx or something. I don't know. Oh boy. That was a propane tank that I was taking cover behind, ladies and gentlemen. I'm falling backwards. I spin to try and brace myself with my hands, but by the time I spin, um, I, I spin, and instead of bracing it with my hands and having time, I spin just in time to hit the ice. So I just spin around right into the ice. There was no point in spinning around. All I did was hit my face instead of my back. And what I did was I had my mouth open and my bottom jaw hit the ice, miracle I didn't break my jaw, and instead I bit the ice with my mouth open, my two front teeth go into the ice and go flying, just shatter. I then pick up my two front teeth and I put them in my pocket. I hate this story, yeah. I put my two front teeth in my pocket and it's a Sunday of a holiday weekend. It was the 4th of July of 2019, I believe. And, and I put my teeth in my pocket did I just get hit by a car? Um, we keep playing. Obviously, I'm not, like, playing, playing at that point. I'm just skating around, like, damn, what do I do with my teeth? I'm just skating around, sadly. I'm skating around, and I'm breathing, and I can feel on my on my teeth, especially my front left tooth, which got completely obliterated. It feels very cold. The air feels very, very cold. Sell them? I can't, and you're about to learn why. What I realized was that I, I had exposed the pulp, like, the nerve that's under your tooth. That was now just in the open. We finish playing, go home. And I'm like, hey mom, uh, what do I do? It's a Sunday, it's a holiday weekend. Like, do I go to a hospital? Is there like a tooth hospital? And there was a dentist, an absolute lifesaver of a dentist. I, I have my teeth in my pocket. I'm like, I still have my teeth. Can they put them back in? And my mom is like, no, what did you do? Why did you keep them? That's disgusting. And I'm, I'm, I'm so sad at this point. I'm sitting there in front of my mother with my hand out and my two teeth in my hand. And I'm like, what do you mean they can't put them back in? Disgusting, exact, that's what I sounded like. That's what I sounded like. And I was at an internship, a really important internship that I wanted to get a full-time offer from where I had to talk. And all of a sudden I talk, I talk like Mike Python. Headed to the dentist and I get there and they're like, well, yeah, we close soon, but yeah, you look pretty bad. So we'll, we'll see you, the dentist will see you. And this dentist comes in, greatest, nicest man I've ever met. And he's like, all right, so listen, I'm gonna try and, and, and make fake teeth for you, but I've just met you. I don't know what your teeth looked like. So do you have any pictures? And I said, oh, I got something better than a picture. I have my teeth. And I reach in my pocket and I pull out my two front teeth. And I say, look, this is what my teeth looked like. Can you make this? And he picks up my teeth out of my hand and he goes, hmm, you know what? and then he takes them and he like holds them up to my mouth. I can probably just glue these back on. I've never seen them break in such a giant chunk. Like they really just clean break, clean came off. And um, <laughs> and I was like, really? And long story short, he glued my teeth back in. And they've been that way ever since. Granted, last year I was eating toast and I accidentally bit them off again. Everyone was making fun of me. Everyone was making fun of me for picking up my teeth and holding my teeth in my pocket. Who's laughing now? Who has their teeth back in? I like my teeth. I genuinely like my smile. Um, and so he put them back in. And uh, moral of the story, if you 
do ever lose your teeth, pick them up. <laughs>